The runner lander was launched in 2008. It has always been, you know, a very nice, pretty part of the uh, Rundle Mall and uh, Pulte Street corner. Uh, never really interactive, something that, you know, lights up from about 6.30 most nights and uh, you get a lot of people staring at it, but that is, that is it, you really can't play with it. Can I have your attention for a few minutes? We're here to promote a little piece of innovation and uh, this is a great piece of work and I want to thank uh, our partner in this infusion. Now with this new venture that we've uh, partnered up with Adelaide City Council, it's now interactive and the community can have a bit of a play and drive what the content is on the lantern themselves. This stuff is absolutely amazing because it runs completely off solar power. There is a solar array on the roof of this building and of course we also pay for green energy. So it's a sustainable, renewable energy uh, piece of infrastructure that I think is becoming a really important part of the Adelaide landscape. It's as easy as just going to www.rundlelantern.com.au and from the website, be it from your desktop or your mobile, you can pick the hashtag and animation you want to show click the tweet button and then tweet it and just wait for uh, the response. It gives me great pleasure to officially launch a direct social media interaction with a fantastic, iconic piece of public art in the city of Adelaide. And with that, and I know it takes a couple of minutes to interact, so we'll see how we go, I officially launch the Twitter interaction with the Rundle Lantern. This is just the tip of the iceberg. Uh, we're setting up the system to do a whole bunch of other stuff, but this is our first step, so keep an eye on the space.